Protect your health. Say no to these seven deadly foods. As a health-conscious individual, I have always been aware of the importance of maintaining a balanced diet. However, many people are not aware of the dangers of consuming unhealthy foods. In this article, I will be discussing the concept of deadly foods, the top seven deadly foods to avoid, the health implications of consuming these foods, alternative healthy food options, and tips for avoiding deadly foods. The dangers of consuming unhealthy foods. Consuming unhealthy foods can have a negative impact on your health in several ways. Junk food, processed foods, and foods high in sugar and saturated fats can cause weight gain, high blood pressure, high cholesterol, and an increased risk of heart disease, diabetes, and cancer. Additionally, Unhealthy foods can cause inflammation in the body, leading to chronic pain and other health problems. Understanding the concept of deadly foods. Deadly foods are foods that are highly processed, contain high levels of sugar or unhealthy fats, and have little to no nutritional value. These foods are often marketed as convenient and tasty, but they are detrimental to our health. Consuming deadly foods regularly can lead to chronic health problems and even premature death. The Top 7 Deadly Foods to Avoid 1. Soda and Sugary Drinks what is the definition of soda and sugary drinks? Soda and sugary drinks are terms used to describe a range of beverages that contain high amounts of added sugar. The definition of soda is a carbonated beverage that typically contains sugar or artificial sweeteners, flavorings, and other additives. Sugary drinks, on the other hand, may include carbonated and non-carbonated beverages that are high in sugar, such as fruit juices, sports drinks, energy drinks, and sweetened teas. Soda and sugary drinks have long been associated with negative health outcomes, including obesity, diabetes, and heart disease. The high sugar content in these drinks can lead to weight gain, as well as an increased risk of developing chronic health conditions. In addition to sugar, many of these beverages also contain other additives, such as caffeine, which can have negative effects on health when consumed in excess. The consumption of soda and sugary drinks has become a major public health concern, with many countries implementing policies and initiatives to reduce their consumption. In the United States, for example, the American Heart Association recommends limiting the intake of added sugars to no more than 6 teaspoons per day for women and 9 teaspoons per day for men. This equates to about one can of soda per day for women and one and a half cans for men. In recent years, there has been a growing trend towards healthier beverage options, such as water, unsweetened tea, and naturally flavoured beverages. These options provide a refreshing and hydrating alternative to soda and sugary drinks, while also providing important nutrients and antioxidants that can support overall health and well-being. In conclusion, soda and sugary drinks are defined as beverages that contain high amounts of added sugar and other additives. Their consumption has been linked to a range of negative health outcomes, and many countries are implementing policies to reduce their intake. Healthy beverage options, such as water, 
and unsweetened tea provide a healthier alternative to these sugary drinks and can support overall health and well-being. Two processed meats. What is the definition of processed meats? Processed meats are a type of meat that has undergone some form of processing to improve its taste, texture, and shelf life. These meats can be made from various animal sources, including beef, pork, chicken, and turkey, and can be found in a wide range of products such as sausages, hot dogs, bacon, and deli meats. The processing of these meats involves various techniques, including curing, smoking, salting, and adding preservatives such as nitrates and nitrites. The definition of processed meats can vary depending on the country and region. In general, processed meats are considered any meat that has been transformed through the use of additives, preservatives, or other methods. The World Health Organization defines processed meats as meat that has been transformed through salting, curing, fermentation, smoking, or other processes to enhance flavor or improve preservation. While processed meats can be a convenient and tasty addition to any meal, they have been linked to various health risks. Regular consumption of processed meats has been associated with an increased risk of heart disease, stroke, and certain types of cancer, particularly colorectal cancer. This is due in part to the high levels of salt, fat, and additives in these meats. To minimize the risks associated with processed meats, it is recommended to limit their consumption and choose healthier alternatives whenever possible. This can include opting for fresh, unprocessed meats, such as chicken, fish, or lean cuts of beef or pork. For those who do choose to consume processed meats, it is important to read labels carefully and choose products that are lower in salt and additives. In conclusion, processed meats are a type of meat that has undergone some form of processing to improve its taste, texture, and shelf life. While they can be a convenient and tasty addition to any meal, they have been linked to various health risks and should be consumed in moderation. To promote optimal health, it is important to choose healthier alternatives whenever possible and read labels carefully when selecting processed meat products. Three, fast food. What is the definition of fast food? Fast food is a type of food that is designed to be prepared quickly and easily served to customers. It typically includes items such as burgers, fries, pizza, sandwiches, and hot dogs that can be ordered in a matter of minutes and eaten on the go. Fast food is known for its convenience, affordability, and accessibility making it a popular choice for people with busy lifestyles or those who are looking for a quick and easy meal. The origins of fast food can be traced back to the early 1900s, when the first drive-in restaurants began to emerge in the United States. These establishments offered customers the ability to order food from their cars and have it brought to them by car hops. Over time, the concept of fast food evolved to include indoor restaurants with counter service, drive through windows, and even home delivery. Despite its widespread popularity, Fast food has been criticized for its negative impact on health. Many fast food items are high in calories, fat, and sodium, and lack the essential nutrients that are necessary for a balanced diet. As a result, 
excessive consumption of fast food has been linked to a range of health problems, including obesity, heart disease, diabetes, and high blood pressure. Despite these concerns, fast food remains a popular choice for millions of people around the world. It has become a staple of modern culture, and its impact can be seen in everything from our eating habits to our advertising and entertainment industries. Whether you love it or hate it, there's no denying that fast food is here to stay. Four, frozen dinners. What is the definition of frozen dinners? Frozen dinners refer to prepackaged meals that have been frozen and can be reheated in a microwave or oven. These meals are typically sold in grocery stores and are a convenient meal option for individuals who are short on time or do not want to cook a meal from scratch. Frozen dinners are available in a variety of cuisines and can range from simple meals such as macaroni and cheese to more complex dishes such as chicken fettuccine alfredo. 5. The convenience and variety of frozen dinners have made them a popular choice for many people. They are easy to prepare and require little effort making them a great option for busy individuals or those who do not enjoy cooking. Additionally, frozen dinners are typically less expensive than dining out or ordering takeout, making them an affordable meal option for those on a budget. 6. However, it is important to note that not all frozen dinners are created equal. Some frozen dinners may contain high levels of sodium or preservatives, which can be detrimental to one's health. Therefore, it is important to read the labels carefully and choose meals that are low in sodium and contain whole, unprocessed ingredients. 7. Overall, Frozen dinners are a convenient and affordable meal option for those who are short on time or do not enjoy cooking. However, it is important to choose meals that are healthy and contain whole, unprocessed ingredients in order to maintain optimal health. 5. Snack foods. What is the definition of snack foods? Snack foods refer to the type of food that is consumed between meals or as a light meal replacement. These foods are usually smaller in size and are meant to be eaten quickly and easily. The definition of snack foods can vary depending on the culture, region, and personal preferences. For example, in some countries, snack foods may include savory items like chips, crackers, and nuts, while in others, they may include sweet items like candy, chocolate, and pastries. 7. Snack foods have become an integral part of modern day life due to their convenience and accessibility. They are widely available in supermarkets, convenience stores, vending machines, and online stores. They are also a popular choice for people who are on the go or who have busy schedules. Snack foods are also commonly consumed while watching TV, socializing with friends, or during work breaks. 8. However, it is important to note that not all snack foods are created equal. Many snack foods are high in calories, sugar, and unhealthy fats, which can lead to weight gain and other health problems. As a result, many people are opting for healthier snack options like fruits, vegetables, and nuts. These foods are rich in nutrients, fiber, and antioxidants, which can help to maintain a healthy weight and reduce the risk of chronic diseases. In conclusion, snack foods refer to the type of food that is consumed between meals or as a light meal replacement. 
They are widely available, convenient, and popular among people with busy schedules. However, it is important to choose healthier snack options to maintain a healthy weight and reduce the risk of chronic diseases. Six, candy. What is the definition of candy? Candy is a term used to describe a type of confectionery that is typically sweet and often consumed as a treat or dessert. It can come in many different forms, such as hard or soft candies, gummies, chocolates, and more. Candy can also refer to various sugary snacks and treats, including lollipops, caramels, taffy, and other similar products. The definition of candy is often associated with its sweetness and sugary nature, but it can also encompass other characteristics such as texture, flavor, and appearance. For example, candy can be chewy, crunchy, creamy, or smooth, and it can come in a variety of flavors ranging from fruity to chocolatey. Additionally, candy can be made in different shapes and sizes to appeal to different tastes and preferences. Candy has a long history and is enjoyed by people all over the world. Its origins can be traced back to ancient civilizations, where it was often used for medicinal purposes. Over time, candy became more widely available and popular, and it has since evolved into a multi-billion dollar industry. In conclusion, the definition of candy encompasses a wide range of sweet treats and confectionery products. Whether it's a classic chocolate bar or a bag of gummy worms, candy is beloved by people of all ages and backgrounds. Its enduring popularity is a testament to its deliciousness and versatility, and it will continue to be a part of our lives for many years to come. Seven, energy drinks. What is the definition of energy drinks? Energy drinks are beverages that are designed to provide an instant boost of energy to those who consume them. They typically contain high levels of caffeine, as well as other ingredients such as taurine, guarana, and ginseng. The purpose of energy drinks is to help individuals stay alert, focused, and energized throughout the day. Energy drinks are often marketed to young adults and athletes, as they are believed to enhance physical performance and mental alertness. However, they are also popular among individuals who are looking for a quick pick-me-up to combat fatigue or sleepiness. Despite their popularity, energy drinks have been the subject of controversy due to their potential health risks. One of the main concerns associated with energy drinks is their high caffeine content. Consuming large amounts of caffeine can cause a range of side effects, including anxiety, jitteriness, and insomnia. In addition, energy drinks can also lead to dehydration and electrolyte imbalances, particularly if consumed in large quantities. Despite these risks, energy drinks continue to be a popular choice for many individuals. They are widely available in supermarkets, convenience stores, and vending machines, and come in a variety of flavors and formulations. Some energy drinks are marketed as sugar-free or low-calorie, appealing to those who are health-conscious. Overall, the definition of energy drinks is that they are beverages designed to provide a quick burst of energy and mental alertness. However, it is important to be aware of the potential health risks associated with consuming them and to use them in moderation.
Health implications of consuming deadly foods. Consuming deadly foods regularly can have a negative impact on your health in several ways. These foods are often high in unhealthy fats, sugar, and calories, which can lead to weight gain, high blood pressure, high cholesterol, and an increased risk of heart disease, diabetes, and cancer. Additionally, consuming deadly foods can cause inflammation in the body, leading to chronic pain and other health problems. Alternative Healthy Food Options There are plenty of healthy food options that you can incorporate into your diet to replace the deadly foods. These foods are nutrient-dense, low in calories, and can help you maintain a healthy weight. Some healthy food options include one, Fruits and vegetables Fruits and vegetables are packed with vitamins, minerals, and fiber. They are low in calories and can help you maintain a healthy weight. 2. Lean protein. Lean protein sources, such as chicken, fish, and beans, are low in unhealthy fats and can help you maintain a healthy weight. 3. Whole grains. Whole grains, such as brown rice and quinoa, are high in fiber and can help you maintain a healthy weight. 4. Nuts and seeds. Nuts and seeds are high in healthy fats, protein, and fiber. They can help you maintain a healthy weight and reduce your risk of heart disease. 6. For avoiding deadly foods. Avoiding deadly foods can be challenging, especially if you are used to consuming them regularly. However, there are several tips you can follow to help you avoid these foods. One, weed labels. Always read the labels on the foods you buy. Look for foods that are low in sugar, sodium, and unhealthy fats. Two, cook at home. Cooking at home allows you to control the ingredients in your meals. You can make healthy meals that are low in unhealthy fats, sugar, and sodium. Three, plan ahead. Plan your meals in advance and make a grocery list. This will help you avoid buying unhealthy foods on impulse. 4. Limit eating out. Eating out can be challenging when trying to avoid deadly foods. Try to limit eating out and opt for healthier options when you do. 5. Conclusion. Consuming deadly foods regularly can have a negative impact on your health. By avoiding these foods and incorporating healthy options into your diet, you can maintain a healthy weight and reduce your risk of chronic disease. Remember to always read labels, cook at home, plan ahead, and limit eating out. Your health is worth it.